of you too. Today we're going to show you how to spray a Ranger roof or any other roof or any other thing for that matter with Raptor U pole bed liner. So it's really easy to put on, really easy to mix, really easy to do, and it makes a super strong, durable finish. Just follow along with it. And we're just going to start by uh, we're going to get some sandpaper, scuff it up. It's just bare metal. Uh, we're going to scuff it up pretty good. And then we're going to wipe it down with some cleaner, some acetone. And uh, that'll be the first step to spraying this with the Raptor liner. Next step, spray it off a little bit with the air hose. And then we'll wipe it down with some acetone. <laughs> Now we're gonna tape off the spots that we don't want covered in paint. Now this kit comes with everything you need except this little regulator. Now you could use a regulator on your compressor, but uh, you know, it's just more consistent to have it right here at the gun. So that way you get a better consistent spray. Uh, these are pretty cheap. You can order them off of Amazon or you can go get them at like Tractor Supply or any of your parts houses but uh you know it just screws into the bottom of the gun you can adjust your pressure all right i don't know if you're ready for how easy this is here's the measuring cup it's got a fill line on it here's the hardener unscrew it fill this up to the hardener line or to that fill line Screw this. Matthew, you put this back down. Pour this hardener into this cup. Try not to waste it like I did there. And then you simply screw the cap back on and give it a good shake. Screw the bottle on and start spraying. Now you want to try to do the hard to reach areas first, but obviously this is just a big wide open roof, so there's really no hard, air, hard to reach area. The way we're gonna do it is spray all of this and then flip it over and rest it on these standoffs and then spray, kind of get up under it and spray around the edge that's not touching the saw horses and the roof. So, we're gonna get all the middle and uh, the seam, or the welded seams. And now you just let it dry. So you see it goes on really nice. I mean, uh, pretty much anybody can do this. I don't have a whole lot of experience painting things like that with a spray gun, but uh, it's not rocket science. It's really, really easy. Uh, and it's really easy to get a good result. So this is just a Ranger roof. Stay tuned, we might do the whole Ranger. That'd be fun. <laughs> 